It's a beautiful piece you have yeah, here. Yeah, it's, it's one of the, the best pieces before. I, 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 I did this piece uh, on behalf of, of these people because I'm also one of them. One of uh, who? One of these people. Yeah. Because I was, I, I'm a, I'm a, a rose, uh, one of the rose people. From so one of these? The rose people. Is the, uh, the Rose people who did this uh, root with a T? Sorry, root Rose, Rose. Okay, all Rose right. people. Okay, it's a tribe. Yeah, okay, it's all right. I'm sorry, I didn't know uh, it's that. It's a tribe. Yeah, so uh, I decided to do this piece, this piece because I saw a, a grade five book which, which, was, which was written the moon and Matilda. Okay, and um, I realized to do it um, uh, to make my history uh, uh, brilliant because uh, I wanted to, uh, to show people how these people uh, think about uh, their king. They wanted to, to, to capture the moon so that they would uh, give it to their king as a uh, as a, a mentor uh, to show that to defend the king. Yeah. So I've written it down. Mm -hmm. So I'd like to, to to read it so that it, it will it will be transparent uh, for for this story. Uh, it is called the uh, uh, the legendary. Rosy clan and the moon. In the pre-colonial era in Zimbabwe, there was the powerful kingdom of the Rosy. It had its center in the Great Zimbabwe, and its influence stretched right across the central watershed through to the Dande region in the Zambezi Valley. Mm -hmm. The Rosy kingdom incorporated groups of different uh, totems Mitupo in Shona, uh, including uh, the Hunga, Shiri, Shoko, uh, Shumba, and many others. Uh -huh. In the kingdom of the uh, Changamire, uh, king was the most revered person. There existed well-organized administrative structure with a clearly defined division of uh, Sorry, a division uh, of authority and responsibility. One of these structures was the jury, that, uh, which was the decision uh, making body. Okay. Um, and it acted as a think tank uh, for the for the king, discussing and initiating ideas of, for the enhancement 
of the welfare of the kingdom. Uh -huh. uh, one night, as the dare was delivered and brainstorming various issues, brilliant suggestion came up. Uh, they toyed with the idea of capturing the new moon uh -huh. and use it as a defining ornament for their king. Okay, so the, the statue, the piece you make, yes. is the building yeah. of, of, of um, a kind oh. of ladder, yes. allowing them yeah. to climb to the lamp yeah. and to capture the lamp yes. in order to give the, uh, uh, to, to capture the moon, of course, I'm sorry, yes. to capture the moon and to give to the king. Mm -hmm. To their king. Yes. And, and it's made in, in, in Springstone, in eh? Springstone, yes. How long are you already working on this piece? I am now in the fifth year now. I'm sorry? It's the fifth year. The fifth year? The fifth year. That's the time you're working on it? Yes. And when do you think, because we see it's not finished yet, Yes. when do you hope it will be finished? Yeah, I didn't you don't know? I don't know the word. No. It is too, uh, a lot of work, but I'm still working on it. Yeah. Uh, it, it will be ready maybe in, the, in a few days. I in think. a few days already? In a few days. So you are almost at the end? Yeah. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so we are lucky to see it almost finished. Yeah, 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 so lucky. Yes. So, um,